uh, sink my teeth into a, a film role. I mean, I'd done a, a few things, but really nothing uh, uh, quite this juicy. <laughs> and uh, so, uh, you know, I knew at the time that, 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 that uh, it was sort of my first opportunity in front of a camera to sort of uh, really, really uh, jump into the deep end of the pool on this, on this, on this medium. And um, I just cherish you know, all the time, I have really vivid memories of shooting this movie and working uh, so closely with uh, Bruce Abbott, who is an unsung hero in this movie, because he is absolutely fabulous in this movie. Uh, you know, I always say, I had the, ce I had the uh, violin, but he had the cello, and uh, it's a great line. He's, he'd, uh, I can't do what I do without him saying, Herbert, no! <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> no, we were incredibly lucky, and it, it was, um, it took a couple of more movies for me to realize how lucky we were that... Uh, yeah, that is true. That everybody was doing just incredible work, and we were all getting along, and we were all making the same movie, and um, <coughs> Brian Usner, our producer, said it was beginner's luck, and I think that's really true. <laughs> yeah, there's a real alchemy in making a movie, and you have to have a lot of... Uh, uh, good choices and happy accidents, and we had a lot of a lot of good choices and happy accidents. And like like Stu said, I, I, you know, we didn't realize it at the time. Uh, you get down the road a little bit, and you go, "Wow!" And, and you know, so many things fell into place. Right. So. Uh, for Jeffrey, I mean, 